Greetings and welcome troops to another episode of Let's Play Regiment. Right. So we have done we are done with the Schwarzball raid. Phase three the line. Jaeger battalions have set a hasty defensive line west of Gottingen. Reinforce them and hold the line. The main forces of the division are still arriving and need time to deploy properly. From Sentak, US 5th Corps and German 3rd Corps, participating in the outbreak of the German escalation. Integrating the latest weapons and organizational reforms, 5th Corps was at the peak of its strength. German 3rd Corps, while somewhat weaker in equipment and caught in the middle of maneuvering at the outbreak of the war, held its ground against overwhelming odds with uncontrollable bravery. So you're saying they're doomed. Alright, so we need to hold the line. Eh? We'll always start with always entrenched and pre-battle pre -battle deployment. So I probably will want to uh, uh, spend some engineer support. And supplies are fine for now. Probably only necessary to invest in this when your fleet's much down to nothing. Uh, Alright, what do I need to upgrade? Restore. Could get another task force, but uh, let's see. Uh, let's at least get one unit of this. We unlock the uh, helicopters. Anything else I want? The scorpions might not be bad. Some light tanks that I can uh, move around swiftly because of the high speed. Uh, do I need artillery and more troops? That's just pensive grenadiers in uh, armored areas, right? They're cheap to upgrade overall, but that would just consume all my points. I kind of don't want to do that. This would give me the most stuff. A Fuchs Jäger, what is a Fuchs Jäger in? Just an APC again. Fast APC, but... Um, mostly riflemen. The weasels, weasels. Mostly I don't know exactly how to pronounce that. Uh, the cluster bombs might be useful. I take them. Rally. That rally, rally is not necessary. Hmm. What do I have again? We have three tanks, some anti-tank. Uh, we want to reinforce that. We have next to no infantry. I might want to actually invest in that. Um, I don't really need more mortars. Let's call these guys in. Alright, so... Upgrade them so we can have the bombs. One point of engineer support. And... Store what units we can. That's what I have to do. 
And some division like that artillery probably will help here. Hopefully we'll be able to hold the line properly. All right. Right. So let's have a look over the battlefield again. Or still. Ah. Uh, we're gonna get attacked for a lot from over here and over here and over there. The enemy has pretty much a free pass to go through this area, although they mostly will focus their attacks on Echo, Shaden, and Buren. And maybe hit Golf, but it's fine. We have the optional objectives of taking that and Niementhal. These are not vital or anything, but they could be useful. Anyway, the most of the action will be over here, which is quite a distance away from our deployment point. So I probably will want some supplies in a forward area. Already some deployment over here. Basic infantry in uh, APCs. These will hold briefly against most attacks, but will obviously not stop enemy completely. All right, let's deploy some vehicles. Definitely want my Leos out here. Some um, Mardis in that direction. Some Fusiliers over here. I definitely want my Jaguars on the field. We will be facing a lot of Armor. And I think I will want to try to take out uh, enemy position over here then move these guys up to the front. All right. We have only our divisional artillery as a card deployed, so some supply that I'll deploy back here. And that's pretty much all I can do at the moment. Not great, but it'll do. So now we get to our actual fun stuff, the engineer support. Would benefit me probably if I put this in positions where I know where the uh, enemy will be. Hmm. Doesn't say what the inner circle is, but anyway. Uh, I know that most units, yeah, most anti-tank from the infantry have is 800 meters, which is fairly good anti-tank. So if I can force the enemy to engage at that range with my infantry, that would be grand. Um, I think I'll place an anti-tank over here and over here and let's get a couple more strong points And for the benefit of me, let's place a couple of obstacles.
hope that this is all right. That'll have to do. Right. You deploy. Deploy. Alright, so the basic idea behind this is that I will dance back and forth between various uh, units in the hopes of keeping the enemy at bay. The uh, anti tank stuff over here should help. Once tanks cross through this forest, because they will, that they get stuck on that and become vulnerable to counterattack. All my units are nicely dug in. But of course, my Leos will have to move about, so. Yeah. Alright, let's have a look what we get. There's only one unit over here, I think. Nope, there is one. There's more. Put the artillery brush. yourself. We're also getting attacked over here, but so far enemies have not been able to do anything successfully. Get you out of that forest so you don't have any cover. Dang it. I still have one anti-air defense. That has a fairly big range, so...
the scorpions over here to help. Come on, kill it. And they won't shoot at us. So far we've held nicely, and it looks like things are going fine. Get you back into position. Nobody is suffering too much. Nope, oh, incoming troops. which makes them extremely vulnerable. Yeah, and that was part of the reason why I'm not all that swift about pushing that. What the hell? Right, go. Tanks have arrived. I was not looking forward to getting and losing any aircraft due to artillery. It's a good thing I didn't summon any uh, artillery myself just yet, but bang. Right, you quickly go and restore yourself. And you also go reload. Oh, they have a brief lull. That's probably more tanks. Looks like some... Units just noped out of there. Zone capture. into position and we got some more incoming scorpions get over here and you fall back
can't do much about those choppers just yet. I don't think I have anything that can really shoot up. Definitely need more deployment points. And we did lose an advance. Oh, oh. Counter battery. Hope that they will go away. Keep a stand over there. Flanks a bit supports. We did lose one of the layers, unfortunate, but not so bad just yet. We have to hold this for at least another phase. That'll be painful. So far, nothing incoming just yet. I do want to hold all the became territories because we will need all the operational authority that we get. Apart from the victory points. Because I don't think the enemy is quite done yet. We want to have a quick peek at what the enemy has. Now, now light tanks are not Particularly the best or the scouting vehicles, of course, but they'll do. And you have a clear vision over this entire field. That's good. And I can retreat you over here. It'll do for now. Even three tanks, you're still quite for not a valuable pack. Yeah. Get enough authority, I probably will want to reinforce this position more. Pull up some tank traps. Maybe put some tank traps across here as well. If I can. Definitely will want to put in some artillery over here or the mortar position. So far, things are looking okay. These anti-tank positions are very, very useful, though. They are running a little low on ammunition. Right, let's go reinforce them real quick. See if you can... Show me what's over here.
Didn't see you though. Let's fall back, fall back. Five minutes remaining. Alright. That's not worth it. Not artillery strike on there. Because those guys clearly do not know. We quit. Yeah, we definitely need more. In order to deal with this, we right. got some incoming. Back. Oh, never mind, they're actually not aiming at that. Right, resupply my Jaguars over here, please, because they strike again. That's gonna hurt. Minor casualties. At least we have got some decent supply coming in. Ooh. B-72s. Charge, see if I can grab those enemy units. One minute remaining. Tango with that. All attacks defeated and the phase, yeah, in 26 seconds we're not gonna do anything to counter that.
All right, 14 dead versus what they lost is not bad. Wounded, okay, missing. We lost six vehicles to 55, and we did lose a helicopter to artillery, of all things. Not sure I could have done it much better, but certainly would have liked to have done better. All right. But that'll do for this episode. Thank you all for watching. See you all next time. If you enjoy my content, please rate, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you all then. Bye.